Welcome back to day number 43 and it is Tuesday the 26th of April 2022. In this quick daily vlog I will show you my transplant area, mid to crown PRP area and my donor area. For anyone wondering I am still taking 0.5 milligram daily of finasteride as well as 5% foam minoxidil daily as well. Currently no side effects on either of those medications. At this stage, day number 43, there is no pain whatsoever. The hair feels like normal hair like it's always been there and it is still early days. I can and I will get thicker hair in those areas. I haven't fully shed every hair like most people do. I have shed a few hairs. I wouldn't say few, but some, but not to the extent of losing all my hair. And that is what I'm grateful for. Very, very grateful. Some people might envy that, which I fully understand, but it's out of my control. I'm happy with the results now. So I know in a few more months time, when it gets a lot thicker, I'm gonna be even more happier. Even after 43 days, this camera does pick up a little bit of red. So you just know that even after like six weeks, you still have a little bit of red. But that's me personally, everyone else heals differently. Some people might not even know red, but currently I have a little bit of red. And just looking at my crown right now, that spiral, of my crown looks a hell of a lot healthier than it did ages ago. I'm gonna be honest with you, I didn't really know I had that much of a spiral on my crown. I was just so paranoid of my crown that I got so upset over it, I didn't wanna look at it. PRP and Finn and Minoxidil are all working how it should be. And time will tell on that because we are still only about six weeks in. I still show my donor in these videos because it's good to see the donor area heal it as well after a second hair transplant. That's it for me today, guys. Don't forget to hit the like button, subscribe. Peace out. Love you all, my subscribers.